Hi, I'm G. And I'm Michelle. And we are the, the Bin, Bin Pickers. Pickers. How you guys doing today? Good, good. Oh, good, good, good. Sold Sunday. Yes. And we sold a lot of stuff, actually. There's a lot of stuff here to go through. So This is what we sold from Friday afternoon to Sunday around noon. Yeah. Plus shipping on everything. Yeah. Uh, almost all the stuff. We get it at the Goodwill Outlet. Dollar twenty nine a pound. There was a few things we got free from Van, and there was one thing we sold that was from a thread up men's box. But everything else is from the bin. Right. Uh, like yeah. ninety nine percent of our stuffs from the bin. We don't venture out to other places usually. <laughs> okay, so um, we did. I sent out auctions, like relisted a bunch of auctions. Wasn't that what I did? I have. I don't remember what I had. We saw some new auctions, too. Oh, we did send out some new auctions, like t-shirts and stuff, I think. And some things that we got from Van, we sent out. Oh, yeah, like auction. doll clothes. And then, um, yes, yeah, so then I, I relisted a whole bunch of exercise stuff that we had for a while that I had out for a couple times. So, most of the auctions was re were relist. Was, right. were, whatever. So, yeah, when we was, get to that. Were. And we, and we sold we sold a $100 item as well. We did. And we so, sold stuff on Macari. We sold stuff on Poshmark. So eBay, Poshmark, and Macari. So not a bad weekend for us. Yeah. So you want to get into it because there's a lot it. of stuff here. Okay. Some of it's really cheap. We did sell some stuff really cheap, but guess what? We still made a profit. Where's your poppy? Profits, profit. You don't let me have it anymore. <laughs> okay. So I, don't so, even, I don't even try anymore. You don't even try. Okay. So the first thing is the mountain. And it's a Thomas Kincaid, like, patriotic, you know, has Statue of Liberty flag on it. And you, Van got this six bucks. Six bucks. You used to work for Thomas Kincaid. Remember Back in that? the day, a long Remember time that? ago, in the 90s. That was a long time ago. That's yeah, before, like, they started making everything Thomas Kincaid, like puzzles, t-shirts, calendars, and everything. It was yeah. just barely anything. It was just really, you know, the art work. Yeah. And then, phew, and you have a bunch of it still. So. I still have a bunch. Well, it was like super cheap. You could go get it for like two or three bucks. Yeah. They'd have like employee sales. It was fun. Okay. Long time ago. Whole nother lifetime. But Van got that shirt. Six bucks. Thank you, well, Van. I think it was the same lifetime. Okay. Well, it seems like a different lifetime ago. Okay. But you'll hear Van quite a bit because he bought a bunch of stuff. Okay. These were hats that we sent out. And these were hats that were realist. Some of them. No, all of them. Maybe all of them. They are. They all were realist. So okay. BMW hat, five bucks. Vintage Sanforized Engineer hat. Um, and that was new. Van got that too. Five bucks. Thanks, Van. Okay, these five bucks, it's really $4.99, but it's easier for me to add up if I just put five, okay? <laughs> Under Armour golf hat. Van got this also. Five bucks. Thank you, Van. Van did say he's sending us two boxes. Oh, he did. He has huh? two boxes for us. So we'll have some unboxing videos okay. coming up. That'll be <laughs> so fun. So sweet. So this is like a maze farmer hat thing, five bucks. 49ers hat. Van also got this. This was new. Well, he bought right? a whole bunch of stuff. Huh? He did buy a bunch of hats. Well, I noticed last week when we sent stuff out, he bid on a whole bunch of stuff. So he's going to be set for hats. So five bucks on that too. Thank this, you, Van. This hat was really cool. It was cool. It has like their old logo on it for the 49ers, yeah. I guess. Mitchell and Ness. Okay. This was also a realist. Opryland uh, mesh back hat. So is that Opryland? Is that is like that the Dolly? Grand Old Opry? Oh, not Dolly Parton. What is that called? Dollywood. Oh. So Opryland, what? It's down in Nashville, right? Like the Grand Old Opry, isn't that what it is? Uh, I, mean, yeah. I don't know. Maybe not. Okay. How much? That's over twenty-eight bucks. Twenty-eight. Bucks. And it was a realist, so that was cool. And Van got this Chicago Bulls hat because he's in Chicago. Five bucks. Thank you, Van. And he got this Bulls hat, too. Well, he got both of these? He got both the Bulls hats. Five dollars on that one. Thanks, Van. I wonder if he likes the Bulls. I'll have to ask him. Well, you think he doesn't like the Bulls and buys two hats? Well, I mean, and if you're in Chicago, you probably like extra like them, right? Hard Rock Cafe vintage hat. Five bucks. Vintage Spuds McKenzie Bud Light hat five no ten bucks ten bucks sorry five ten bucks <laughs> ten dollars on that one this is kind of cool Space and Rocket Center Huntsville Alabama 
Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, that sold for twenty two forty nine. That wasn't an auction. That's something we had on Buy It Now. Mm -hmm. We've had it for a long time, and then we sold it twenty two forty nine. That's cool. This was the one thing that was from a thread up men's box, and I think we paid like three dollars three forty a piece. What was it? I don't remember exactly. I can't but... remember either. I had it written down, and I have it written down, but I don't remember off the top of my head. Starter Rangers jersey twenty six twenty five. We did all right on that men's box. I mean, when we were opening, it, it didn't was kind seem of, very mm, good, but we made money. We did. We definitely. We didn't make a ton of money. We off probably this like stuff, but. just doubled our money, I guess, or probably maybe a little bit more than that. I have it written down, but I don't remember exactly. I was keeping track, and now I'm like, meh. <laughs> Pack a vest. It's a bulletproof vest. But, but it doesn't have inserts. No inserts. And it has some wear on it. 15 bucks on that. We've had it for a while. Um, it took an offer. I thought it's better, but... What can you do? Now we're into Macari stuff. This is Macari? Yes, I sold these on Macari. Duluth Trading. These are like the heavy ones. You just got these. I just, just got showed these. these. They're, they're like last. Carhartt, but they're Duluth. Yeah. And we sold them for $22 on Macari. Okay. The next thing we also just got, it's a Milwaukee M12 heated. It doesn't have the battery with it, um, but you can buy the battery separately, I guess. Yeah. But this is a woman's jacket, uh, sold it for 40 bucks. I put it on for 50. Somebody offered like, after like an hour I had it on, they offered 40. I'm like, okay. I gave it a little time. I let it simmer just in case. But then I was like, I'll take 40 bucks. Sounds good to me. Pays for everything we got. And maybe we could have bought a battery and sold, and it, sold it for yeah, more, but because people had used, but the batteries are like fifty bucks. Are they? And then it's like people had used ones with batteries for like hundred and fifty bucks. I mean, I could have, but eh, what can you do? Yeah, no, I sold don't have it to worry now. About it. Spanx, you just got this too. I don't this like is... to put fifty dollars into my stuff. No, you know me what neither. I mean. Spanx Encore, um, like Shaper bodysuit Shaper twenty three dollars, mm -hmm. and that's also from Macari. Why you sold a bunch of stuff on Macari, huh? I did. When that M12, that Milwaukee thing, so evidently the thing where that's right here, you press it, and then it can heat up, and then if you press it again, it heats up more or something like that. Wow. So it's just right here. You just press it to heat up. That's kind of cool. Well, I'd like to have one of those for me. I, <laughs> I know, right? Okay, here's another Macari sale. These are new with Tag Avenue. We got these recently. They're darker denim, 20 bucks. Okay. They are heavy. And you got to love Macari. They just take straight up 10%. And I don't do free shipping on Macari. I know a lot of people do. I just charge shipping and use their label that they send me. Mm -hmm. I know you can probably, you can ship, like I could ship those cheaper than what Macari charges, but yeah. I keep it easy on myself. Ugg boots, 18 bucks. Those are little girls. They're sparkly. They're cute. Like to keep it easy. Well, I mean, it would save the other, it would save the buyer's money, you know what I mean? But then uh -huh. I got to go into PayPal or Pirate Ship or however you're going to ship it and print the label. And that was, it was kind of confusing, remember? Like to do, and then you got to put the thing in. Anyway, most of the stuff is not that heavy that we list anyway. Okay. It's usually first class, which is cheaper on the car. So these were like relist exercise. Cause this okay, let me see where we're at. Two really yes. cool Athleta skirts. Skirt. Now, this was exercise. Most of this exercise we had on Buy It Now. I had on Buy It Now. And then we sent it out to auction, like, pretty high. And then we sent it out to auction again. I think I've had this out four or five times. Yeah. So, we sold those two skirts six bucks. Six bucks. A lot of these lots were six wah, bucks. Wah. No, but hey, somebody's getting a good deal. And, and we're, we're going to get, get rid of, of a bunch of stuff. Two-piece Lucy set. It's little short shorts. Like, and oh, they're so cute. Too. I know, and a shirt that totally, absolutely, 100% doesn't match. Well, this is completely a match. I would totally wear that. Look at that. That sold for six bucks. I bet you if you would have just listed these by themselves, because I could have figured out I what they were. I could have sold those for eight bucks. They're probably. the half the collection. Yeah, you probably could have sold these for 15 bucks by themselves. But, you know, whatever. What can you do? Put them together, sell it for six bucks. <laughs> yep. Okay, Cooley Bar. Woulda, coulda, shoulda, I guess, right? Cooley Bar Kids. It's like a sun protection shirt. Amy got this. Thank you so much, Amy. Six bucks on that. That was the auction that we thank had out a few you. times. So thank you, Amy. And then Robin got this Cubs, <laughs> Cubs uh, t-shirt for six bucks. So thank you, Robin. I thought it was funny. So Christine, she had sent me a message this morning. I get on the computer this morning. I wake up. I look at it. She's like, 
it wasn't that. It was that other men's shirt. She's like, this is supposed to be Chicago Bears, but I had put Cubs. I don't know what I was thinking. Yeah, she put <laughs> NFL Chicago Cubs. <laughs> Whoops. So I appreciated that she sent me that. I've had a couple other people like, hey, <laughs> this is wrong, or you spelled this wrong, or are you sure that's right? So I appreciate that when I make mistakes. Yeah, sometimes. Sometimes I mess up. Sometimes work you too hard and... That's it. You make mistakes, huh? So this is a four-piece Adidas lot uh -huh. that we sold for six bucks. Six they got bucks. a great deal. $1.25 a piece, right? Pretty good deal. That's a good deal somebody got, and we're getting rid of it. I know. People are going to say, how... There's just take your time. Takes you all this time to list that stuff. I know, but and, when we made up all these lots, I mean, we sold some for twenty, thirty dollars. I'm assuming. Yeah. And, and then we sent it off to auction and sold some for ten, fifteen dollars, whatever. And then this is what's left. Yeah, and this is basically the end. Just end trying of, to get rid of it. Because this is right? a five-piece Athleta lot. He's like, why do we get Athleta anymore? I don't even know why we get it. But I think but, some of these we should have listed by themselves, or yeah. just not even get it anymore. I don't know. Cause this sold for eight dollars and five cents. Pants. A cute sports bra. And um, shorts, shorts or a skirt. It's skirt. a skirt. Yeah. It's cute. Pretty good lot for how much? Eight dollars and five cents. Eight dollars and five cents. And that's cheaper than a thrift store, so that's good. Somebody, I mean, they did pay shipping <clears throat> on top of it though, so. Here's another three-piece Athleta lot. We used to do so good with this exercise, though, and it's getting harder and harder to. It is. Sell it. You know, you know and sometimes I mean? we're stuck in our ways of like, you know, putting the stuff together and then. That's me. You, she doesn't ever want to, but then you put one thing on and it doesn't sell. And I guess some of these didn't sell several times either. So when you put them together. so I'm not a fan of lots, but. Three more. Three piece athletic, $6.50. It's almost all athletic stuff though. But and I think a lot of it was small. This has a little bit of a it's from the string. Pocket. You'll have to cut that off. <clears throat> I know a lot of athletic like I think the athletic larger sure. sizes are better. Okay, so Debbie got these next two lots. This Debbie is two Under nice Armour, super cute, like capri leggings. Uh huh. Yeah, she sent me a message. She got them for her daughter. Well, I hope her daughter's for not, Christmas. Not I hope she's watching. not watching. <laughs> so yes, thank you, Debbie, for getting these. I hope your daughter loves them. These are super cute. They have like meshy back here mm -hmm. so that's two under armor 650 and then she got her a three-piece nike lot mm -hmm. uh for six bucks so hey that's a lot of cute stuff for christmas yeah it has a little tank top and some little running capris uh -huh. so debbie thank you so much thank you i know she had sent a message she's like oh she'd like to see the kids you know because she has kids and she's like they grow up so fast and it is really true you know when you really think about it I mean, I think about, like, Rose, she's going to be 17. It's like, what? Wait, what? She was just a baby. Three teenagers now. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, your birthday's coming up here pretty soon. Wait, your birthday's tomorrow. Yours is first. Oh, no. And you're older than me, so. I'll probably go to Ben for my birthday, huh? Of course you will, because that sounds like fun. So, But, Debbie, thank you so much for yes, getting those. We appreciate you. it. This quilt, we've had it for a long time. She wouldn't list it. She eventually, finally did send it out. I mean, it's pretty thrash, but it's really cool. It's not too thrash. There's some rips on the scene. This has this <clears> cool, <throat> like, sun and moon calendar fabric. But it also comes with a Smurfette. What? What is that? I don't know. Where did it come there? from? One of your kids must have stuck it in this bag. because. But no, your... I wanted to show this. This is so cool. This Davy Crockett. Yeah. Isn't that cool fabric? So that was like 50s, 60s fabric. Yeah. Well, it has like 1955 license plates on it, too. It's really cool, the fabrics on it. But it does need to be, like, refreshed and sewn up in a few places. And it's just the top part. Yeah, and it's not a... We sent out to auction. Pretty snow. The person actually bid three times, but nobody else bid, so it sold for 10 bucks Or nine ninety nine. But, you know, what can you do? Okay. So, we got that. Okay. Now, what do you got? Speedo, Speedo 12 bucks. Just basic Speedo. Logo, Lori Goldstein. This is really cool. Or Gold, however you say her last name. It's and this like, was our $100 item, right? No. No. This was $18. $18. But it's super cute. The hem and it's like textured. Uh-huh. Super Yeah, that cute. sold for 18 bucks. American Eagle shorts. Kelly got these. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you, Kelly. We did pretty good bucks. selling these. I, 
I, all the ones we've passed up. I know. And over the we, years. So. Well, it, it was Dizzy Angie, wasn't it? Like Angie, that's like, oh, the American Eagle stretch, you know, shorts and the jeans and stuff. Yeah. And then we, so we started picking them up and we sell them. So you know, thank, not for a ton, no. but they sell. Yeah. Thank you again, Kelly, for buying those. And then we sold this Aviva, you know, girls, Lululemon, $9. This Uptown Swim. This, I thought this was really cool. I know, and a lot I mean, of people it's said so it was so high cut. I'd, you'd have okay, so things sticking I know people out of different areas. Commented, said it was a leotard, but it is a bathing suit. It definitely feels like a bathing suit. Yeah, um, and it's not vintage. Yeah, if it was vintage and like that, yeah. and a vintage leotard, it'd probably be about 40 but, 50 bucks. Man, that is. Okay, so twelve twenty five on that. Okay. And this vintage Tommy Hilfiger jersey we've had for quite a while. I thought it was so good when I got it. And now we sold it for twenty bucks. But I'll uh, take twenty yeah, bucks. We sold it. We did. It took a long time. I'm trying to figure out where I'm at because I got a lot of stuff here. You're right here. Oh, I'm where I'm at on my papers. I got oh. my papers all written out. Okay. There's more okay, stuff. Okay, I see. We're going to do these boys' eyes odd. I, I was think, surprised. I think Van uh, sent us these. He did send us those, and I was surprised. I sold them on Poshmark for 15 bucks. Yeah. The person didn't even offer. They just bought them. They're, so thank they're 18 you. husky, so probably a hard... That's true. A hard size to, size to find. Yeah. And then ASOS, this cool tiger shirt with like the cutouts. Well, it's like ties in the back. I should tie mm -hmm. that up. Two bows in the back. Super cute little t-shirt, 15 bucks. Mm -hmm. And I'm not sure if it's somebody, they might watch us that bought stuff on Poshmark. Because you know you can't really put a note like on your payment or anything. Like you can oh. eBay. So if I miss somebody, I'm sorry. But thank you if if you did. This was a Green Bay Packers Matthew jersey. It yeah. has like bling on it. I've had it bling. listed for quite a while. I took an offer of 12 bucks. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Football is coming back pretty soon, yeah? I, I think. think so. These, we just got 11 stitch designs. They're linen yeah. pants. They have these funky pockets. A little pocket over here. Yeah, a lot of pockets for only 11 stitches. <laughs> 11 stitch design is the brand. Oh. And I sold them for $20 on Poshmark. I was kind of surprised it was a Poshmark sale. Because it seems more like an eBay thing. And then one more thing for Poshmark. Was this your $100? No, this is not my $100 no. item. This is Affliction. We just got this, so it's really cool. It's, it's reversible, lace on one side, camo on the other, women's size extra large. But this is kind of like camo, like. Well, because too, you right? can see but the camo through it, right? Actually, camo on the other side. Right. So yeah, reversible hoodie, uh, thirty bucks. I I couldn't find one like it. I priced it high at fifty dollars, and then somebody offered thirty dollars within a little bit of after I listed it. And I'm like, I'll take thirty. Yeah, bucks. there was no other one. Because I wasn't it, really right? sure when we got it. So that was all my Poshmark sales, that Affliction yeah. and all that stuff. I like the camo stuff, so I pick it up. True. New Attack Burt's Bees little baby um, set, 10 bucks. It has a gown and cap. It's so cute. It's so cute. And then this Patagonia, $35 for a retool fleece. Retool fleece. And then we just got this too, fresh produce dress. Oh, I didn't mm -hmm. even notice I had a pocket. I don't even know if I put that. Cute little pocket right there. 19 bucks. This is super cute. It the is super cute. Super comfortable. So the fresh what? produce, we'll usually pick up the dresses, you know, right? Usually. Well, we picked up that one. We did. I guess if they're cute. He right? doesn't pick them up. It's me picking it up. He's like, mm. Is it? Pretty much. Herschel bag, like a duffel bag. It does not have the long strap, but it's in nice condition. Uh, sold it for $25. Okay. Well, we did sell a lot of stuff. We huh? did. Okay, so Christina got a whole bunch of stuff. And there's another thing she just got today. I had... There was a thing. on my, You know where you can send offers? And it said you could send a bunch of offers. It was like seven offers. So I sent the offers. And then she went in and bought all this stuff. Oh, so it was her... It was her I was sending offers to. I was like, oh, it's so sweet. And then she bought a bunch of it. Yeah. Or she bought it. But you don't you know? know that when you're sending offers. I don't know who it is when I'm sending right. offers, right? Well, and then I feel bad. She paid shipping on all these things. So I need to print her shipping label and then refund her the difference because I know she paid shipping on every single thing. Okay. So she bought this? She got this Torrid, 12 bucks. Thank you, Christina. She got this cute Vera Bradley, 13 bucks. 
that's like a perfect bin bag, I would think. Yeah, this, is like, this looks like something you would I know. carry, huh? This too, this looks like something you'd carry. No, of course it's you not. don't. You don't have diapers no. anymore, wipes, None of all that, that stuff. stuff. Does that make you sad? A little bit. You used to carry a big purse like this. Now you just have a little purse. Sadness. Sadness. New tag and Misi bag. It's super cute. It has big like chunky wood bead things. That's fourteen bucks. Thank you, Christina. She got more. She got more. New tag, New York and Company. This was a friend in Kentucky. Remember, sent us a box yeah. of stuff. We don't even know who it is. We I don't know. know. Nobody ever told That's me who all it was. Said on the it thing. just said a friend. Yeah. So they had sent us a box of some stuff, and this was one of the. And things we sold that was some in of there. the other things. That yeah, were in we did. There, there was quite a few things that we sold. Wait, how so much? That's all for six bucks. Six bucks. And then Christina got this prana sweater too. This is cute. It's like lightweight kind of sweater. Yeah. Perfect like for California. Big, big cowl neck. neck. Cowl. So that prana sweater, twelve bucks. And then this new tag, hot fox. Is that what it is? Like a tunic. It's like a knit tunic. Well, it's almost a dress. Huh? It could be like a dress, depending, you know, or you could wear it with leggings or whatever. Eleven dollars on that. Depending how long you are here. Right. Guess, right. Like me, it'd probably go to my knees. <laughs> right. Uh, probably go past, past my knees because I'm so short. And then she got this Rudy art purse, super cute, like color block. It's a vintage purse, and eleven dollars for that. Okay. And she got one more thing coming up. So, Christina, right thank here. you so much. Okay, so thing. she got this. And where did I write that down? I wrote over here, Tyler Jacobs t-shirt. All you need is love. Just kidding. All you need is coffee. Yeah. <laughs> so, Christina, thank you so much for that. You wake up, you want coffee first, then love. No. No, no. coffee. Blech. Oh, yeah. Every, I need to say all you need is Diet Coke. Every morning starts with some coffee, right? <laughs> for you, yes. So again, Christina, thank you so much. It was so fun though. And she was like, I sent all these offers. And I'm like, hey. <laughs> it was like cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. So that was really cool. Okay. Okay, so now I'm on to something else here. And I got to yeah. figure out where you're uh, at. Soft surroundings. Mm -hmm. There's two of them. They're the oh, same. They're right here. Just different color. I put them together. And we sold them for 15 bucks. 15 bucks. And they're in a bag. Like, this is this is the kind of bags he uses. See how they're all ripped out? He likes to store stuff in that kind of bag. We lived in California for a while, so you gotta, you gotta, you gotta like, keep your bags. Use your bags conservatively. Yeah. Now we have so many bags, it's like, but we still like hoard them just I in think case. California went back to using plastic bags again, though. Oh, with everything going on, because they don't want people to bring in their reusable germy bags. Yeah, I think so. so I don't know. Well, maybe that's not right, but I heard that. <laughs> It's interesting. Okay, so we got this. This was an auction. Indy 500 Pink Cat, six bucks. And this is another auction. This is really cool when I look this up. So it was, it's from the 50s. It's a Hollywood yeah, head topper cool. where you can wear it all different ways. Who was the I don't model remember that was, who it was, but I someone can't. modeled it and everything. And I put that in my it. listing and then like a screenshot of the Picture. I don't remember who it was, but it. I, I can't remember either. She was she like some famous Hollywood like movie star, you know, yeah. and Jane Mansfield. I think that's who it was. But obviously, it wasn't that good because it only sold for how much? Seven fifty. Seven fifty. But I'll take it. It's super lightweight. I thought it was really cool. I'm sure if I would have marketed it better, or maybe used better keywords or something, maybe it would have been better. So it's your fault they didn't sell very good. You're saying probably. Okay, okay, this was this was from Van. He sent us all these doll clothes, little doll clothes. Yeah, they're like there's Barbie. a hundred and thirty plus pieces, and some said Barbie, most didn't. Though. Right, and I said that in the listing. And then so you you and Rose like laid it out, took pictures. I sent it out to auction. It sold for thirty one dollars. So that was awesome. Thank you, Van, for sending us that. Okay. He also so sent us here. these. Yeah, be careful with that. I don't want anything to fall out. These were like knit or yeah, so um, like crocheted them, right? doll clothes. And some of them fit Barbie, but some of them were a little bit bigger. Yeah. Um, but they're so cute. Like a lot of them are little oh. sets. Yeah. Got some little... Yeah. So cute. Those sold for six bucks. Somebody spent a long it was time making pieces. these. But they're old, huh? Yeah. And Van sent us those also. So thank you, Van. And they sold for how much? We sold those for six bucks. And it was 16 pieces. Did I say that? I already said that. Probably. 
New tag, Under Armour. It says like Anderson Water Utility, Utility. Union thing. 15 bucks. we sold that for. Okay. You're going to pile over there. There's a lot of stuff. I know. Agrigold, like Farmer Hat, eleven twenty four. I think this might have been one that we sold before out to auction. And, and they then they it. didn't pay for it. So I relisted and buy it now because that was a buy it now. Okay. Now this, we're back to auctions. Vintage Mickey Golfer T-shirt, six fifty. This Indy Motor Speedway vintage T-shirt. I thought this was really cool, but it didn't sell for. Yeah, much and it's like all over print, a single stitch. It's definitely vintage, um, but it sold for. Where are we here? Six bucks. Yeah, I thought it was dreams. cooler than that. You win some, you lose some. I hear kids yelling upstairs. This next shirt is BS. It right? Is, it is. It's a bull shirt. It's a bull shirt. shirt. I had to get it. It's old. It's cool. Somebody, it's handmade by Ellen. Yeah, Ellen Frazier. made this. It it has some like you know. I just saw it was really cool. It says bull but shirt all it's over like, it. It's like a velour. Is that what it is? Or terry cloth? It's like a towel. You know. Yeah, I mean, someone made it, but it. I thought it was cool. I it's sold for it six fifty. Only sold for six fifty, but it's cool. So this was interesting. There was 23 people watching this sweatshirt. This must be the $100 item. No, it's not. Well, there's only one thing left. So. Okay, it's the last thing. Camp Jim Riley staff. This was like a 60, 70 Towns yeah. craft, it's right? It's old. Yeah, it's Towns. Towns craft. JC Penny. Penny. Yeah. Yeah, I think that was a 60, 70 tag when I looked up the date. It has spots, paint. Whatnot. It does. Bleach. And it was, I was like interested to see because it only had like one bid, and then at the end it got bid up to $14.94. There was like 20 some people. 23, watching. yeah. So it was interesting. Okay, so now we'll show you our $100 <laughs> item. Now he just picked up. I just picked it up, and I'm like, let's send it out to auction. We sent it out. Now Somebody... everyone can see every, all Ryan in here and everything. So it's, it's thrashed, it's in bad shape, coming apart. There's like no brand on it whatsoever. But there was a size. Yeah. I sticker. thought it was really cool. We sent it out to auction. Someone wanted to make an offer. I put best offer. They offered a hundred dollars and no one else offered anything. And so I And like, he debated. You know, he is like mm. well, I'm but, like, let's just take it. So we did. Hundred bucks. Hundred bucks pays for all the stuff that we got. And then there was another one so, he had with this. So all last night and today, like this morning, he's like, I should have got that other helmet. I should have got the other helmet that was with the it. The other one wasn't actually as thrash as this one. It wasn't. But this chrome, chrome I guess. Chrome like. Yeah, like mirrored uh, is pretty cool. Yeah. So that was a $100 item. But it's really bad shape. But. Hey, 100 bucks, and it's it's beat up. and. Um, it's going to California. I'll take it. Okay, so we spent $51.60 on all that stuff. Fifty one sixty is our cost on everything. And we sold everything for nine hundred and twenty-one dollars and seventy-two cents. And after almost hit that thousand, almost, almost hit that thousand, almost. Maybe next weekend. It's hard to get to a thousand. It is, but we, you know, the you know, over the weekend, helped. Friday to Sunday. Friday it's hard to Sunday, to sell right? And then we, um, so after fees and cost of goods, we profited. This is a, this is like an estimate, okay? Because I didn't go through every like Poshmark's twenty percent, Macari's ten percent, you know, eBay is about 13 percent are we running out of time here sorry um profit was 750 dollars and 29 cents our return on investment gross was 1686 so 16 times our money return on investment net was 1354 so 13 times our money so that's pretty good that's about where we usually like to be and we had a good weekend and we're so thankful for all the sales that we made this weekend and we have a bunch of stuff to print I'm so excited. We have a bunch of stuff to print. Print, like labels. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Um, hopefully, we can keep right on selling stuff. Yes. Pick outside the box. Get some different stuff. Sometimes it's just a thrashed helmet. You can sell it for 100 bucks. You just never know. You know? <laughs> I debated getting it or not. I'm glad you did. Helped okay. us have a great weekend. And thank you so much to everybody that bought stuff. Um, we really, really appreciate it. We're so thankful for every sale. Hope you guys have a great weekend. God bless you. We'll have a haul this week. Okay. Thank you. Bye.